Hey everybody, Michelle with Michelle's Frugal Living here. Thanks for watching my videos. And uh, today's August 1st of 2017 and being the first day of the month, it's always a good time to look for new coupons to print and um, check over the rebate apps um, to see if there's new offers and things like that. So Saving Star put up like I don't know, 34 or 35 new rebates today. So a whole bunch of them expired yesterday. And then, um, and so most of them are those big G, you know, uh, and Betty Crocker products, um, that they put up the first of every month. And most of those I noticed on, uh, coupons.com had, uh, corresponding coupons to go along with them. Okay. And then also just take note, uh, you know, I say any of the rebate apps because yesterday I looked through Ibotta to see if there was any deals I wanted to do. And I wrote down some and then I looked at it again today and half of them disappeared. <laughs> so they ended yesterday. Um, so just be sure and check, you know, that happens because of, you know, it doesn't matter what day of the week it is. If it's the last day of the month, a lot of things expire that day. And be sure and check over your coupons, too, because a lot of them expired out yesterday. Um, so, anyways, um, one of the new rebate apps that I started using is called Fetch Rewards. And I appreciate you guys using my referral code. It's right here, EE0HW. Um, and uh, because I have been getting uh, some people who've uh, submitted a receipt and I've gotten 1,500 points for you guys submitting a receipt and you get 1,500 points um, when your receipt gets approved. And it's really simple. I think I've, I've only taken pictures of three receipts, I think, um, and it's approved them. And they have a list of things that you get points for, but I don't have any clue how many points you get for stuff that you buy. And my one Kroger receipt that I actually bought the caress on that I was going to, um, I should have got points for caress it didn't even recognize that i had caress on the receipt and it had like really goofy things it like made things up because it obviously didn't read the receipt quite right but it gave i i have no clue I, but i did get points for it so i guess that's the significant thing although i submitted a a, a recheck on the receipt and told it i bought caress so i and i don't i don't know the nap is still really new so i think they've got lots of bugs to work out but um, anyways, I just went ahead and submitted some other receipts that I didn't see where, uh, I bought anything that was on their list of things that you can get points for. But I think if you just submit receipts for any receipt, like you, you probably, you can get some points for it or something. I don't know. I've got no clue. And so, but I know that I've gotten points for some receipts that like, there's nothing on their list and you don't, it's like you take, just take pictures of the receipt. If you go back over to the place where it says redeem or submit or to a snap or whatever that is, um, it might ask you to verify some of the products that you bought. I guess they, you know, because my Kroger receipt just said pop tarts and they wanted to know what kind of pop tarts I did. So, and until I did that, it didn't approve the receipt. So anyways, you might just check that again, but, um, yeah, um, it seems fairly simple to get some points at, at least at, at this time it does. Anyways, <laughs> let's move on. Um, so yeah, there's new coupons on coupons.com. Um, so $5 on, um, some Clary spray, and I know that 60 count one of that has been on clearance at Rite Aid, and it counts towards allergy rewards. I don't remember how much it is, though. But if Clary spray and Flonase is putting out coupons, there's probably a deal coming up. Um, these blue plate um, mayos um, have Ibotta rebates, at least at Walmart they do. And then dollar on the Cascadia Farms and at Kroger as part of the mega event for $1.99. So here's a dollar off coupon and Saving Star has got a dollar back on that. Uh, the Yoplait, of course I buy yogurt all the time. The Puffs, oh, and some of these reset. Oh, there, I printed more than one time. I just do this one in here because this one I got Viva paper towels on and then the pop tarts coupon that one obviously reset from yesterday because it let me print them again the huggies reset three dollar coupon there's three dollars on some avino uh, coupon um the bounce two dollar coupon obviously reset and that's part of mega event um 
here's some big uh, razor coupons I thought I'd print. And there's the Flonase coupons. So I went ahead and got those. Um, the Newman's own salad dressing, and that's on Ibotta. Um, I do like that salad dressing. Um, Dollar on Glide. Dollar on the Cottonelle flushable cleansing cloths. Okay, and then dollar on two of those little Purell hand sanitizers. This is just what I printed. And then I printed these as my test page, and of course my printer worked this time. Invariably, if I print a test page the first time I try to print from there on my computer, it works. If I don't print a test page, something happens and it jams up and I lose my coupons. <laughs> but it worked today. So, but anyways, there's these Scott and um, Cottonelle coupons on there for a dollar if you want them. But anyways, might go check out uh, coupons.com today. I'll talk to you guys later.